Well, I cleaned up the floor in here yesterday. And then I walked in to find this, a giant duck or chicken poop. Uh, they never come in here in the daytime. And I guess when they know no one's watching, they're coming in here. I got other things to worry about right now. I'm just gonna ignore it. I can't ignore it. It's a big piece of poo. It's not even a piece. If it was a piece, I could pick it up. Right, get rid of this poo. Wait a minute. I think between this and this, I can do it. All right, no more poop. So I wanna do the third floor, the floor of the third floor. And I did some experimentation yesterday with what I've got. And I can make this without a ton of trouble. It's kind of a pain in the butt. Because uh, I have a, a, basically I have a router bit that I can get to do this. But do I want to do that? Or do I want to just cut the sides flat and nice and stick them together? Maybe even glue them together. I don't know if it's worth doing this to all those boards. Regardless, I need to cut all the sides of the boards nice and make all the boards the same width, which I should be able to do on this here machine here. Here, this machine, this 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 here machine here, right, right here. Oh, I guess I need to put a tabletop on here. Wait a minute. Nah, those aren't long enough. goes up to there so maybe I should take this and slide it over do I want to pet that chicken um when I'm out when I'm outside I think this needs a really simple holder not This is the straightest piece of wood I've got. some boards through this and get some nice edges and consistent width. Supposedly. Storage space. 
Get everything off the stairs. I guess I should test this before dragging the bulldozer over here and then plugging in inverter in and doing all that. And I have this thing, which is a battery charger. So it can charge four batteries. But then if you push, let me make sure they're all on right. Okay. Push that button, then uh, the electricity gets sucked back out of the batteries, runs through an inverter, and I can plug stuff in. And it's 1800 watts, which is more than enough to run this thing. So let's give it a test. All right, first thing to try is just cut a groove in this. Well, let's just turn it on first. Sounds good. make a nice square edge on this. Get out of here, dirt! I just made this clean. Too bad. Oh, do I dare try ripping the side of this off? Think I'm gonna have to do it. It's funny with so many different moving parts to make sure they're all locked in place. Batteries are doing. Hmm. Wow. Says so they're all still pretty much full. Excellent. Wonder how long I can power this thing with that thing. Maybe it's actually usable that way. Well, temporarily. I definitely want to have a solar panel charging between cuts and stuff. I wonder what I need to do to sharpen a carbide blade. It can't be that hard. <laughs> 